Right, and we are back here for map two for this historical rules event, and I am once more joined by Major Matt from the 13th Georgia. How are you doing, good sir? Doing good. Kind of living on the high. We, we, we did very well last night. See what this one comes. This can go either way. So. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And it is, let's take a look. We got a Cox's push here. 325 on the server pop. See, 161 for the CSA defending, 164 for the Union. And uh, we'll look at the CSA team first. So they have on their team, 20th Georgia under Major Canada. Uh, Sauce is leading the 4th Georgia. And we've got DB under Lieutenant Ilya. We got 13th Georgia under Captain Potato. Excuse me. Then we got 11th MS under Pistol Pete. ANV under Killer and Gamebot TKO under Society. And Molex is joining in. Ah, so we got one of the devs hanging around. Let's see, then we've got EB on the guns. All right, so Mr. Potato, what can what do you think we'll be seeing from him for, on this match? Well, Thirteenth loves this CSA right side. Usually, be well where he's at. Recommend just sitting here, try to uh, try to bait some shots, get uh, get Union to move into this open field, make Artie do the work. Yep, and oh, wait a second here. Wow, we already have an engagement. A and V moved all the way up here to almost the top of the hill, doing some initial Yeah, firing. I was about to say they are pushing very, very, very hard. That is pretty aggressive oh, for go. the Union early on. What do you think? Well, Union, for the CSA early on. What the do you CSA. Think? Yeah, oh, what, what do you think about that? I, well, nobody died, so that's a good thing. No, nobody nobody <laughs> dying is generally a good thing. Yes, this this is true. Uh, we have the UEC contingent coming down with clubs. And AB and TKO need to pull back, like, hard. There they go. 7 Cav is with them. Oh, I hear Victor. Oh. By the way, it's his birthday. Everybody, make sure you uh, send Captain Victor a nice birthday message. Yep. Spam his. Spam his uh, Discord messages. Yep. <laughs> in the Fourth New Jersey channel. By the way, um, if you're interested in joining the 13th Georgia with Mr. Major Matt, um, there is a link in the description. Um, they are playing every. Uh, was it Saturday, Sunday, right now? On UBC. Uh, yeah, we play Saturday, Sunday. Yep. We have a. Uh, Two EUs and one NA on uh, Saturday. Yep, so you got times for any time frame you want. Nice, uh, I want to say low key, but laid back maybe. Maybe laid back is the right word? Yeah, we, uh, we are laid back when we're laid back. Um, like I said, uh, you can join the reserve corps. You want, you know, you got a heavy, heavy time card. You got to work, you got school, you got things. You can join the reserve corps. And you can uh, join and play as you want. And as long as you just hit that sash bot and let us know uh, when you can attend, that helps us out. It helps our numbers. So, Absolutely. And by the way, I've also left a uh, link to their YouTube channel in the uh, community page. If you guys want to check out some of the products, they, those guys are putting out as well. It's like seeing uh, more YouTube channels for units coming up. But, um, we'll start on this fight, though. Looks like, um, you were right when we were talking earlier. It looks like Eddie is, uh, lined up against your boys here. On this far right side for the CSA. Oh, you got HL, too. I thought it would be Eddie and, uh, 4th New Jersey, but, uh... This is a sizable force. Some good volleys coming up. Yeah, nice, uh, robust volley command there by Mr. Potato. Where are they yep, at? Copy. Eagle loads. is not on top of a yep, rock. Yep, yep. <laughs> Give that man a medal. <laughs> oh, but wait a second. Union is coming sure. down on him. Um, do you think they should uh, pull back now or try to get one more shot into him? I would say it looks like they're stopping, so. Oh, they are pushing now. Yep, potato nose. Yep, good shot. Yep, exactly what you said, Kotal. Pull back. Yep, it's hard to tell, but I think that was uh, as far as you could stay on that one. You don't want to end yeah. up, you got Lamat here chasing after you. Probably should have went a little bit sooner, but I mean, hindsight. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not seeing 
Yeah, I'm seeing a couple go down, but not eh, a couple more Three, going down. Yeah. Yeah. Four. Ah oh, man. It's all right. He's pulling back. It's the right idea. Going to these rocks with DB. So it looks like the CSA is sending some forces now okay, down to the center. Do you think the Union will make a uh, charge right now for the point, or do you think they'll... Uh... Yeah, I doubt. Shoot. Just shoot right now. You got cover. You got, uh, wait till you get uh, bayonets. I mean, no reason to move right now. Tickets are pretty balanced. Yeah, a little bit towards CSA, but... Uh, and you got 11th and Mets trying to come up on this charge here. I'm glad we got the server message for Captain Victor. Very glad to see the admin supporting him. Question is, is it really his birthday? If not, next weekend it's probably his birthday. Well, you know, at some point I'll be right. <laughs> right. You know, you know, unless he tells us it's not his birthday, I'm only going to assume it is. <laughs> he needs to make a server announcement. This is not my birthday today. You know? <laughs> yeah. 11th MS did a really good job against uh, HL and uh, HD. Yep, they, they did pull him back. They retook that position. Do you think they should uh, just maintain there, or do you think they should try to push them off of that corner as well? No, I'd maintain independent fire, and I'd recommend 13th go yeah, go. back. And, and support. Yeah, it looks like Potato joined him again, from what I can see. Yep, there he's back there. Oh, it's just a couple of my guys on the uh, flag. Yep. He did go with him. That's a good good call out. You already knew. And they're out shooting him. Yep. Check the center of the fight here. It's been a while since I looked at that. Oh, that was short. There was a nardy shot. It was very short. Did knock some guys down and uh, did get some more shots on the uh, Union, so I guess it worked in a way. Get a couple shots in on him, yeah. I'm always hesitant about using too much already though early on. Worried about ammo management. Well, they're in the open though. Yeah, I mean, it can be. It's just again, it's you know, it, it's fine. It's just. A, don't want to overest, you know, overhit it. Looks like they got only two case on, so I guess you're kind of right. They will run out of armor pretty quick. Yeah, and one of them's a uh, forget. I think it's a 12 pounder. So it's actually a few shells less than the uh, the other cannon. And 11 MS and 13th are uh, charging in. Oh, let me swing back over. See, this is why I like us having different streams, so I'll go and check something else out. And they're like, oh, no, main action over here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, two officers and 11 MS and 13th. Looks like they're going to clear. And they push them back. Like you said, it's about even, a slight advantage, I'd say, for the CSA. But, uh, That's one thing about Cox. It can go either way. <laughs> I don't know if 11 MS should pull back. Probably we'll need them. Yep. Oh, they're about facing, so. Alright. Yeah, they pull back a little bit. So now for the. Uh, what do you think about the way the CSA has set up for this defense so far? Do you think it's uh, working pretty well for them, or would you change anything, you think? No. It, this is standard. I mean, you got one unit. And a flex unit like 11 MS, you got a big unit in the middle here, uh, being able to flex and do, you know, help right or left. So uh, thank you 11 MS for saving our ass. Um, that's exactly what you need to do. Everybody else needs to be focused on this corn. Hold this corn with all costs. And uh, no, I wouldn't change anything. So really, the corn you'd say is really that decisive terrain you got to hold yeah. on to to win. If you lose it, you're probably done. Right, oblique. 
It's very hard to get that corn back, so. Looks like we got the, uh, your cousins over here, the 20th and the, and the 4th back on the far side, so. Made some good holds last round. We'll see if they can do it again. <laughs> They're doing alternate volleys, and that's the great. That's great. It was very crisp, too. Fourth. Fort oh, Georgia yeah. and then 20th. Oh, Sauce died. Poor Sauce. Oh no, Sauce! We've got a bit of a maneuver here. What's going on? 88th moving up here? Alright, pushing in the middle here, it looks like. Coming up oh no, on that's LFL. Yeah, on the far side. Looks like they're just doing a volley and falling back. Got a couple nice shots in on them. Oh, the whole NYV's up here. I would say something about the Union. They are in a really good spot. They're kind of ready to charge. I mean, once those bayos hit, ex I would hope they would expect a whole charge by Union. Straight to the corn. And 11 the mess is there, and hopefully 13th, which is being pushed now. Yep, they lost the rocks. Yep, Union's really... Uh... Staying pretty aggressive. What do you think about the Union being aggressive on this flank here? You have to. You have to. If you can hold this rocks, which is uh, a they very good move by HL cap. and HD. Uh, they hold tickets. these rocks, and now, once that bayonet's hit, if they see that as Union and go hard, take these cornfields, I think that's I know, huge. Yeah, I agree. I think the Union... Attacks through the point through this way towards the corner. I think it works out very well for them. If you're saying we cap early, we cap early. Man. I think we should do it. Game we should we do are it. engaged for the Union at 30 minutes, but CSA, I think, is pretty close behind them. Nothing. Anvi and uh, TKO kind of needs to pull back a little bit and hold this corn because it's coming. Or not. Oh, Sprinting and Bayo's now live. We'll see where the attack lands. Do you think the Union launches an attack right away or do you think they continue shooting it out for a little bit? It looks like continue to shoot, shoot it out. Let's see. Yep, they're just shooting it out right now. I disagree. I mean, get in there, get aggressive. That's the best point. Again, hindsight, they don't see everybody in the corn. There's only a couple of units. You could definitely charge that out. You still hold the, yeah, you still hold the rocks on the right side, or uh, Union, Union left. Um, you could do a lot of things right now. You own this battlefield. Yep, and CSA has just hit engage, so as far as tickets go, 29 minutes hit engage. It's not not horrible. It's not bad at all for this map. Oh, wait a second. Are they just ditching forward here? Oh, wait, no, we are. Don't fire. Looks like they're just inching forward. And now it, it's fully reinforced in the corn. Yeah, I think the opportunity might have been lost. Yep. I haven't heard Artie in a while, but I don't think I've, uh, oh, on this side. Oh, that's a shot. Speaking of Artie. They were just waiting on you to say something, you know? <laughs> right. Don't know if they killed anyone, though, but, uh, it was a good shot right on the rocks, so. Hot barrels, hot barrels! Oh, it looks like the Union's moving some troops away from the rock. Disagree with that. Okay, yes or no? No. Yeah, you got uh, HL moving back. Oh, they're trying to take point and get them uh, baiting. Looks like they left HD to guard the rocks. Oh, they don't want us to cap, is what uh, Eddie said. Well, I would go back to uh, the rocks and uh, keep up independent. 
Yeah, I would agree. If you're not going to cap there, then yeah, I'll go back to that other position. Oh, wait, is the CSA going forward? Oh, I would disagree with that. Oh, Pistol Pete in the lead, huh? I mean, they're big, but it doesn't matter. I don't, I don't, uh, I don't agree with this at all. I, I don't like this. Ignore, ignore like three units. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you can. They, you know, they might not, you know, let you, but yeah. Well, they are pulling back, so they didn't see that opportunity they could have uh, shot into uh, loving that mess. This might actually work. Yeah, they're punching through him. Oh, wait, here comes Ninth Corps and CQB now hitting into the flank, though. See Dragon leading the way. Yeah, it's too late. Yep. Yeah, Gamebot coming up to enforce, though. Oh, and Gamebot got destroyed. Poor Gamebot. Yeah. Let's see, the Union's still kind of flooding troops here back into this corner, kind of haphazardly, to be honest with you. I'd recommend pulling back. Don't don't be this aggressive. You don't need to be. Yep. So we got uh, six New York coming up. Pilots moving in this direction now. Well, it was kind of weird. You got A and V falling back and A and V coming back in. <laughs> Eh, split right decision, you know. They are getting good shots. Yeah, I just be careful about staying here too long for the NYV. It's a bullet sink right here. In the middle here? Yeah. Yeah, you could hang out here for like a shot, but once the CSA figures it out, <laughs> they're gonna already you. Looks like CSA right is uh, being very covered. Still, we got HD on the rocks. Keep up the fire. And you got yeah. HL. Yeah, they really. The looks here. like they've given up on contesting those rocks on that side. What do you, do you think they should uh, put some more uh, emphasis on retaking those rocks from the CSA? No, don't be aggressive. I mean, again, you're defending. Oh, well, Potato's talking about it. They all have to go together. JL or JDL and uh, Baby all need to go together if that's going to work. To be honest, what I would do is send a runner and see if we can get one unit, smaller unit, come help. Yeah, I think they need a little bit more to take that back. Because you got so much, you know, Union behind it, you know, HL and two USC that can reinforce over there. But the Union in this center field here is just getting pelted here by shots. I don't know about maintaining this position here. Raid volleys. Pretty sure that was from the 20th and 4th. Yeah, it's the guys on this far side here. So, yeah, they've been doing those alternating volleys very effectively. Just more now. There's so many dead Yan Yankees up here. Yeah, it's, it's, and you can see the tickets. It's really starting to, it's, it's starting to hurt. Problem is, you only got one flag, so you're not spawning in fast enough. Like, if you had two flags over here, maybe you can maintain this. Although, you got a decent position on the rocks here by that point. So much open ground, they got to try to do if they want to do an attack. Although, we got the NYB here. Do you think they should make a play for the far uh, CSA left on the corn and just try to get in there while they're distracted? Oh, they got to go together. You got to have a big force. Uh... Oh, Victor is talking to him. Maybe, maybe something's happening here. Oh, wait a second. We got that assault you were talking about earlier on the other side of the map. Let's do that. Retreat, retreat. Everything in game. Thirteenth Georgia leading the way. Run away. You got DD with JDL. 
Well, they pulled him back. I wouldn't go any further. Independent fire. Yep. Yep. Good shots. Yeah, pull back. Get back on the rock. No, I would agree with that. It worked. Yep, they retook their position now. They did not overextend. To be honest, if HL would have noticed that, uh, they could have helped HD and uh, that would not have worked. Because they would have been able to swarm. But, hindsight. Get that flag in the field! Focus fire on the flag! Focus fire on the flag! Yeah. Looks like 2130, Victor said they're gonna charge. Yeah, let's see. Uh, oh wow, so the CSA moved up. Now 11th MS has taken this front of this wall here. Dang, I'd send it off now, to be honest with you. Yep, that should be what it's going. Here goes. And hit, hit, left. hit that far right side, I would say, I think. They're kind of a little bit spread out. Yeah. You need to hurry. And I think they're Spend a little bit too far to the left, too. Yep. They're just getting chewed up right now. Got Fort Georgia and 20th over here. Yeah, I think you got to try to knock out Fort Georgia. I think it should be the objective and just get into that and corner. We just noticed Killers, killers moving up. How'd you miss? And so is 11th that mess. That's a GG. Oh, I mean, it might be, but I, I I still think it might be worth it. If you get some good, you know, melees in the corn here, you might get some good tickets out of this. Yeah, you're not wrong. But nobody's in the corn. You got to hit this uh, wall. Yeah. Oh, wait. So, Killer's moving in now, so. Oh. I'm moving. Let's see that ticket train. Let's see. Nice, nice. Get rid of that flag. I would, uh, I would say that the ticket drain went towards CSA, though. Uh, I think you're right. I think, uh, yeah, they lost. Well, A, I think there was a couple things wrong with it. I think, like you said, it was a little bit too spread out, and I think they wandered too close to the wall. I, I would have tried to just push in through the corn, mm -hmm. walk over Fourth Georgia, just keep going, just get into the corn. Yeah, you got to keep moving. You got to be quick. So, I think once they got uh, kind of stopped there on the wall, it kind of broke it. Looks like the right side CSA is uh, holding well. They pushed up. And they're getting tickets. Everybody's skirmishing out. I bet you that's Eddie up here. It is HD, I'm sorry. Oh, I hear Eddie in there. <laughs> He just got shot too. <laughs> no, he's still alive. Oh, it wasn't Eddie. Who, who got shot, Eddie? Who took a die for you? <laughs> who took a round for you, Eddie? Now I think the word term you're looking for is autistic. Is it autistic or autistic? <laughs> Apparently. Apparently the pirates, I guess. We're autistic. It's always good uh, listening into two USC. They have very. Oh yeah, they have a good time, and that's what it's all about. And then the end of the game, one thing we always lose in this one, when we're leaders and doing things, it's uh, it's a game. You know, we're here to have a good time, and uh, we forget that. Oh yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's fun to win too, but you know, you, you don't. Oh wanna, yeah, of course. You don't want to, you know, you want to enjoy it. You don't want to just, you know. Back to swing back over, see what else doesn't look like too much else is going on in the battlefield. Killer's got a good move going. He's uh, supporting that to right. If he can uh, support 13th and everybody over here, we could uh, probably take those rocks. But then again, that might be at their own peril because you see on the Union side, on the Union right, they're coming up again, trying to charge. Yeah, we'll see if they go in right away. I think they should need to take a second here and get get, get consolidated before going in. Just take 30 seconds. You know, kind of at the top before going in, because this is a little straggly. If they go that in was for a charge. A big team kill by Artie. They destroyed CSA. Oh, did they? Oh, I completely missed oh, it. Oh, it was, it was bad. Yeah. But red mist, but wrong red mist, guys. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm not sure about this centering no. on this rock position here for the Union. No, you need, need to be aggressive. Like, like I said, killer's over here on the right. You got a point. Hit him. Like, hit him hard. EB, please Don't be check who you were shooting at. <laughs> <laughs> That was uh, very devastating, but it still looks like uh, we're winning on tickets. So. Yeah, looks like Killer's moving up again. Oh, but his flank is a little exposed here by who's coming up on him. The NYV, but man, they got they kicked the hornet's nest here. HL's moving, HD needs to enforce, and we got some HL's not didn't hear the order. Um, gotta get those NCOs yelling at them, get them going. HD should go with them. You gotta be aggressive. You got Southern's pulling back, NYV. Yeah, I think it was a little too late. I agree. Um, even on players. So, I mean, we're at 16 minutes. CSA still had engaged, if only barely here. Almost, I'd say, full morale stayed ahead, just about. Just about. And what, what do you think the union's got to do to kind of get back into this now, you think? Ah. At this point in time, you need to pull back, pull up in the staff light, talk together, figure out a plan. Maybe, maybe work. I, I, I don't know at this point. Uh, I'd probably hit Union right. Just full send. You've got 15 minutes. Just keep sending in the scorn as much as you can. Everybody. Nobody holds back. Charge van adds straight to the corn. Uh, but we'll see what happens here. They all bunched up. Yeah. What, about the, what about the CSA? Do you, do you think they're being a little bit too uh, aggressive yeah. right now, or do you think yeah, it's fine? Yeah, I was going to say, no, 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 I was, I was going to say, if, if I was them, pull back, and uh, you got CSA being aggressive, hit them with everything, and just wipe, wipe units, and hit this corn, and then hold it. And then once you do that, hit point, and you probably got this. Yeah, you see you got A and V on this other side too, charging up against the LFL here. I think they might have overextended a little bit. They are getting shot down. Good shots by LFL and SB. Eleventh is pulling back, but it's just a couple guys. <laughs> yeah, but again, if I zoom out right now, it's it's too bad they don't have more reinforcements. But look at how much yeah. the uh, CSA has dumped out of the corn right now. Mm hmm Yep, exactly. They're too aggressive. Come together, make a plan, hit it. And now they're on but you have to be losses. quick. You do have to be quick because yeah. they'll, they'll figure out the error here pretty soon. So. In fact, they're already starting to send some troops back, it looks like. So. Yep, yeah, I think that's a window shut down. Blue screen. I mean, as aggressive as the CSA has done, again, I gotta say, it just, it's working, so I don't know if I would change it. No, it, it's, it's, um, it's high risk, high reward, but it, right now they're getting the high reward, so, you know. Yep. And we're still out shooting on the right side here, CSA right. Looks like 13th is... Uh... Yep, they moved up to the... Yeah, Potato's up on the wall right now. Let's take a look at him for a little bit as the Union gets reset. Oh, is he going to follow him? No, they're independent. Oh. Oh. That was beautiful. Yep, very Chris Folly there. Three. 
Yeah, CSA's moved back down now. That window's definitely closed. I don't know, man. I might hit the uh, I might hit the right and just cap. I'm thinking. Hit the uh, Union right or CSA right? CSA right. So Union just hit all right and yeah, just uh, you know, make them make them come out. Yeah. Make, make it a yeah, lot. I mean, I mean, time. I mean, you know, make those nice big fat lines the Union likes to make. Make them come out. Yep. In in the open and make it a gunfight. You know. I shoot them. Yep. I would agree. Uh, I mean. At this point in time, you got to be desperate. So yeah, I mean, earlier I, the corn is definitely the better option, but I, I the CSA has this too well locked down right now. Yep. It looks like they're kind of taking their time back there, so I think they are having an officers meeting. In fact, I'm gonna swing back there and see if I can. I see a bunch of stars all together. Uh, somebody got deleted by Artie. We're fine. <laughs> Everyone died. Oh, Lord. Sounds like HD and uh, Second US and HL got uh, hit very hard by that Artie. Good shot. I missed it, but I, I'm assuming they could. Good question. Uh, looks, like, looks like they're going to go down the stone wall, which I don't think I agree with, but. No. <laughs> They're talking about their line being uh, kind of off. To be honest, it looks looks crisp. They got some uh, also great NCOs, great uh, COs. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yes, All right. Looks so like A and V is going to fall back very wisely, I think, here. Probably need to fall back quicker. There they go. <laughs> Again, to spread out, you need to go together. You got people on the rock just chilling. You need to go in with them. Yeah, I'd agree. This is it. I mean, this is... I don't think they're going to get another chance here for this. They're getting out shot. As we still sitting there, you need to move. And CSA is counterattacking out of it. The problem is now there's another attack on the other side, but you know, it's a little bit late now. Way late. If they would have synchronized that a little bit better. Eddie <laughs> hey, <laughs> serenading. <laughs> You got DB 11th, and if 13th comes around here, and I bet you they're waiting on that flank. Yep, they noticed. Yep, they saw that flank. They're gonna hit him in the Look ass. to your left. Look to your left, boys. Look to your left. Behind you as well. Behind you as well. Behind yeah, you as well. HL's about to get hit in a pincer here. Push up, push up. Right, Turn around. And good job by yep. Potato seeing that. Yep, great job, Potato. Nice pistol shots. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Rest in peace. Yep, that's the end of that. Keep holding him. Charge at them. And you still got an V fourth, twentieth over here in the uh, corner. So, well, actually, I don't know if corner twentieth is there, but still, it's pretty a uh, pretty good hold. Yep, and that is a total wipe now for the Union. I would agree with us now. I mean, you got plenty of tickets, got plenty of time. Just uh, be aggressive, get up a little bit up top here with CSA. I think uh, 13 should probably move up. Just, just take the field. 
No, I, I, shooting. I agree at this point, just take the field. I think you're absolutely right now. You have, you have plenty of time, plenty of tickets. You can fall back if it gets too much pressure. Yep. Um, there's no point in letting the Union possibly get a miracle cap in here, you know, keep yep. them off of it. Which can still happen, you know. It's one of those things It's you know, if you get a really good concentrated attack and, and sneak cap, you know, you could still potentially win. It's a long shot. Very long shot at this point, but... But it's still there. It's still there. And 13th didn't notice that. Yep, they're occupying the hills. Or the rocks, as you say, not the hill. The, the rock on the hill. <laughs> what do you think of uh, Mr. Potato's performance so far today? He did good. Great, great awareness. Uh, yeah, yeah. He did a lot of, he just knew kind of what was going around. He's looking around. He's trying to see what's going on. And uh, he was an infantry uh, CO for a while, way back when. And now he's our, my, my uh, arty captain. And, uh, but he still has got that infantry nose, so to speak. So. I see Eagle has gone back to the rock uh, ways. So you know, a bit of a regression there, but that's okay. <laughs> surprising Molotovs weren't used in the Civil War. Kick -caw. Mr. Eagle. It's good to drink all the alcohol. Yeah, huh. Would have been a misallocation of military resources. Molotovs in the Civil War. Well, you, the thing about it is, you know, you don't want to be uh, close enough to an enemy line where you have to throw them to, to hit them. <laughs> right. Kind of exactly. the, the problem with the Molotovs. <laughs> it's like, oh, why didn't they use grenades? I mean, they did have, you know, fun, you know, some of them, but it's more of a siege, you know, type of thing. No, that they actually did have some grenades, kind of. They did, some rudimentary types, yep. Oh, here we go. Oh, well, they're doing exactly what you uh, said, Kotao. Go yeah, down the middle. I, w I wish they took a bit of a bigger left hook on it. Um, it kind of came through the 13th Georgia, and not given my back to the 13th, but, uh, you know. You just come down here, you just come down here, take the point, and form a, you know, a fuck you battle line, and make it a fight. Again, this is a little bit too shallow, though, is the problem with this, because now the CSA can charge right into you, before you're really set and got your battle line set. And Coyote and, uh, Potato have made good decisions there. My uh, scout officer. Notice them, hit them in the ass. Got nobody in the corner right now. Yeah, see, the CSA was able to get behind them and kind of collapse that. That was a problem. They need to form up in a way that. Uh, they wouldn't give their backs to the enemy. So, you know, and the point is so far out here. I mean, it's like, that's like the damn tree where 13 Georgia was before and still the point. And they're destroying flags and that's, uh... Right, back up, back up, 13. Yep. Back up, back up. That was GG. Yeah, well, I mean, you, you, conceivably it's three minutes. They could oh, get, no, well, get one more yeah. charge in. Am I expecting a win? No. But... No, no, no! I didn't. I, I meant the charge was a uh, GG. Oh, but, uh, okay. Yeah, they yeah, can yeah. absolutely get another charge in here. They got to be aggressive. They got to go together, and uh, they could hold this. I mean, it's final push, taking losses. You got to try to hit them into breaking. Oh, they'll you take it. Yeah, they should hit them into breaking as they're taking it. I would be surprised if they don't. Yeah, that last one. I just. I mean, now I would say you have to take that route. But last one, I, I wish they kind of went through 13th Georgia and just rotated in. But. Mm. I'd agree. I don't think they knew they were there. Sir. No, probably. I mean, maybe not, but still, I would have taken that route anyway, even if I knew they weren't there, just to, you know, give yourself well, a nice, secure, some... blunt, you know, flank, you know, so you don't, you're not getting shot, you know, charged in the back. Right. Kill us first. Rolo checking out, uh, scouting. That's a good idea. See what the Union's doing. Yep. Yeah. Yep, he's just hanging out on top of the hill and just taking a look. Get a rest, get a break. Join the ship. Uh, Victor, you gotta go together. You gotta wait. Victor said point right now, you need to, you're gonna yeah, be spread you, you, out. You could take 10 seconds at the top of the hill, man. Yeah. I'll be honest yeah. with you. I would disagree with that order. 
You, I know you don't uh, want to, and I know you just want to go, but it's like, nah, you really could take 10 seconds, man, just to get the rest yep. of everybody online together. And again, nobody notices the 13th just chilling over here. With the flag to have a chance. Come on, go, go, go. Get down to the point. Right. No, 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 oh, no. Potato's right. Old. Get him, get him. Up and over, charge Up and over, charge Come here! I want your shoes! Give it to me! Oh, they want his shoes? Yeah! That was beautiful. Sorry, guys. Sorry, Kato. No, no, you're good. Oh, yep, here comes 13 Georgia. Now they're charging in. They had a great shot on them. They they killed quite a few people. It was it was nice. a great, great timing. You did a good job waiting until the uh, full Union uh, team was into the uh, kill zone. Aww. Uh huh. Uh, Rollo says he had to do it. All right, so that's the end of that one. Um, that I'll call it there. So, uh, what do you think overall, both for the thirteenth and uh, for the overall map? Well, they're overall. I mean, like I said, I think uh, Union. Uh, you know, they, they again, they still got the the best lines. Uh, they can outshoot if they get in those positions. It's all about communication. Like you need to go together. You need to be a unit together as a big blob. Um, for the thirteenth. Great awareness by uh, Rolo and uh, and uh, Potato, uh, especially on that second map. Uh, that was amazing. Just seeing what was going on, waiting for those hold, you know, holding. NCO did shout out, "Hey, we could do this now," and uh, NCO or CO said no, and that was perfect timing because wait a second, let them come past and then hit him, and uh, it, it was very very well done. Um, yeah, that's what I'd say. Yeah, I agree. And uh, once more, I want to thank uh, Major Matt Cawthon here for joining in. Um, hope to get him in again uh, maybe another time. But uh, again, check out 13 Georgia at the uh, link below. And, um, yep. Pleasure having you, man. Thank you for having me. All right. See you all next time. Uh, this is Coattail signing off.